Two things I want to make clear before we get into this. Number one, Kyrie Irving did not apologize. He says he takes responsibility. That is not an apology. Number two, he is also not spreading this on his social media. The Nets are spreading it on theirs. But it is labeled a joint statement from Kyrie Irving, the Brooklyn Nets, and the Anti-Defamation League. The events of the past week have sparked many emotions within the Nets organization, our Brooklyn community, and the nation. The public discourse that followed has brought greater awareness to the challenges we face as a society when it comes to combating hate and hate speech. We are ready to take on this challenge, and we recognize this is a unique moment to make a lasting impact. To promote education within our community, Kyrie Irving and the Brooklyn Nets will each donate $500,000 towards causes and organizations that work to eradicate hate and intolerance in our communities. The Nets and Kyrie Irving will work with the ADL, the Anti-Defamation League, a nonprofit organization devoted to fighting anti-Semitism and all types of hate that undermine justice and fair treatment for each individual. This is an effort to develop educational programming that is inclusive and will comprehensively combat all forms of anti-Semitism and bigotry. So we'll take a moment here. Reading this, how do I read it? He's basically getting a fine. That's how I read it. They basically said, look, you're going to have to do something. And they said, well, make a statement that, you know, you, you understand what you did and uh, you'll give money. I view this as the team telling him he needed to pay a fine, personally. Now let's continue on. I oppose all forms of hatred and oppression and stand strong with communities that are marginalized and impacted every day, said Kyrie Irving. I am aware of the negative impact of my post towards the Jewish community and I take responsibility. I do not believe everything said in the documentary was true or reflects my morals and principles. I am a human being learning from all walks of life and I intend to do so with an open mind and a willingness to listen. So for my family and I, we meant no harm to any one group, race, or religion of people and only wish to be a beacon of light and truth. And in nowhere in that do they actually apologize. They take responsibility. The film, the, the claims in the film, all it would take is a Google search to know they were anti-Semitic. But don't worry, he doesn't apologize for spreading it. He just takes responsibility for spreading it. Yet again, why I think this is more of a fine situation than he chooses to do this. There is no room for anti-Semitism, racism, false narratives, or misguided attempts to create animosity and hate, said Sam Zussman, chief executive officer of BSE Global, parent company of the Brooklyn Nets and Barclays Center, now more than ever, there's a pressing need to ensure education in these areas. We are putting our prior statements into practice because actions speak louder than words. At a time when anti-Semitism has reached historic levels, we know the best way to fight the oldest hatred is to confront it head on and also change the hearts and minds. With this partnership, ADL will work with the Nets and Kyrie to open a dialogue and increase understanding, said the ADL CEO. At the same time, we will maintain our vigilance and call out the use of anti-Jewish stereotypes and tropes, whatever, whoever, or wherever the source, as we work towards a world without hate. Well, the biggest sources recently that have made the most news in these circles has been Kyrie Irving and Kanye. Uh, we've also, of course, seen people say that Kanye should get in contact with Kyrie. I don't think Kyrie Irving is done. He didn't apologize. He just took responsibility. Is he going to say something else and then think he can just take responsibility after? In past years, the Brooklyn Nets will continue to support and participate in Shine a Light, a ongoing initiative dedicated to spotlighting modern-day anti-Semitism. Additionally, to ensure a sustainable and meaningful impact in driving awareness and education on the important topics of hatred based on race, ethnicity, and religion, the Brooklyn Nets, New York Liberty, and the team's affiliated organizations will host a series of community conversations at Barclays Center in Brooklyn. In partnership with ADL and other national civil rights organizations, as well as local community associations. So, honestly, what I expect is maybe a week, two weeks, maybe we'll get a month, and Kyrie Irving's going to say something just as bad about Jewish people. He's going to push something else anti Semitic, or he's going to push it for a different race or something else, because I cannot imagine, as long as he's using social media, he can stop himself. Because remember, 
He doesn't apologize. He's just taking responsibility.